All right, so welcome back. In this lesson, we're gonna talk about STLs versus G-code. And I get this question a lot from beginners, is like, what is an STL? What is a G-code? What are, what are all these things? So really, the STL uh, is a 3D object. That's what you're gonna be exporting out of Blender. Like in this case, uh, I'm in Cura uh, slicing software here. This is an STL, this is a 3D object. It can be an OBJ, it can be lots of different things, but most of the time in the 3D printer world, it's an STL. Um, there's a few others, but usually it's an STL. So an STL is the actual 3D geometry that you created in a 3D program and that you brought into your slicer. And so that is what the STL is. And the and the G code is actually what you're going to be slicing. So when we slice, it's chopping this design up into layers of G code. And that is the language that your printer understands. So all these little movements here are actual pieces of code and just numbers and lines of sequences that are going to tell your printer exactly what to do. Um, I'm not a huge programmer, so we're not going to dive too deep into it. But that's all you really need to know is that STLs are the actual 3D files and G code is the language or the kind of the file that you're going to send to your printer, usually through like an um, SD card or something of that. So if I hit save to file, that's actually saving the G code, right? Because that's the file that we're going to send to the printer. So I would just save this as, you know, this is my PTT logo and maybe, you know, which printer am I going to? This is for, uh, we'll say it's for the CR10 depending on how I had it set up. So now I know that G code is this little logo 3D printed for this printer. So you can save that. And now we have some G code. So hopefully that helped um, kind of explain the difference between the two. And now let's go ahead and jump into the next lesson where we're gonna talk about what it means for an object to be watertight or manifold or ready to be 3D printed. Let's go ahead and dive on in it. 